People often think that the sea is full of life, that everywhere creatures of one size or another swim. However, that is not true. In fact, the open ocean is almost a desert with nothing to eat and no one to eat it. This is not the case of this coast. When the cold waters reach here and rise to the surface, they come into contact with the sunlight and warm up. And it is precisely the presence of light that works the miracle and causes life to flourish along these beaches. The seabirds catch small fish and crustaceans, which in turn owe their abundance to the plankton and microscopic algae that thrive close to the coast. These seabirds form colonies of thousands of individuals and contribute to fertilizing the water with their excrement rich in nitrogen. It has been scientifically demonstrated in other areas of the world where conditions are similar that when these bird colonies disappear, it is not long before the nearby waters lose a large part of their population of small fish. This has not happened in southern Australia. Here, the chain of hunters and hunted is maintained intact and ready to take maximum advantage of the gifts sent from the Antarctic in the form of dissolved nutrients.